New developments in the story we broke last night at 10 o'clock. A seven-year-old hit by shrapnel when gunfire erupts outside a Southwest Houston tire shop. Tonight, one of the men involved in that shooting, a manager at the shop, is behind bars. Our Keith Garvin spoke with his co-workers and is joining us live now outside that shop. Keith? Laura Bill, this is a 24-hour shop, and as you can see, they are often busy. They know each other very well because they spend a lot of time together working long shifts together, but they say none of them ever expected their workplace would become the scene of a shooting. All of a sudden, I heard a screeching of tires and it sounded like someone being drugged, and next thing you know, I heard a pop. The 24-hour tire shop on the South Loop in South Houston is normally a pretty busy place all hours of the day and night. But Wednesday evening, it was a scene filled with chaos, an argument between a customer and employee in which witnesses say one man attempted to run over the other with a car, and the other fired a weapon that injured a 7-year-old. I just heard a gun gunshot, and that's it. Santos Castro was installing a tire Wednesday evening evening just after six o'clock when he says one of his managers 25 year old Royce Thomas got into an argument with the customer who was there with his son at one point Castro says the man got in his car with the boy to drive away and then the guy reversed and then he hit my manager and my manager jumped on top of his roof on the little corner because I see his leg getting dragged witnesses say the car pulled onto the feeder road and dragged Thomas about half a block they say at some point either before or after Thomas pulled free the shot was fired shrapnel from the bullet wounded the seven-year-old. They say Thomas ran back to the tire shop and about an hour later was arrested by police. One of the most senseless details of the incident is that the argument allegedly started over the cost of filling tires with air. The guy was just upset and raised that he had to pay a dollar for tire. Yeah, back here live, they say as a result of last night's shooting, the shop will put in place some new security measures. In the meantime, Royce Thomas remains in jail on aggravated assault charges. The seven-year-old, his wounds were minor, and he is expected to make a full recovery. Reporting live from South Houston, Keith Garvin, KPRC, Channel 2 News. All right, Keith, thank you.